this is happening right under your nose and you are not even aware of it this is prayers and counseling with Damaris. If you see me for the very first time, you're welcome. I love you so much. God bless you mightily in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you for this awesome word. We give you glory. We receive this word with gladness. We love you, Abba Father. But we thank you for your love. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. These words I'm about to tell you, you suspected it. You, you had a conviction, but you fought it. You're like, no, I don't want to believe this. I don't want to believe this. Someone very close to you has been the very problem that you've been facing in your relationship. And you've been doubting, okay, what is happening? And you even go and confide to this person. You go and update them about everything that is happening. You cry to them and then... You 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 feel like they're your comfort, your confidence, but we fail to understand that those persons are the real enemies, the real people behind your problems, the same people that go and they stab you behind, and you've been crying and begging them. You felt this thing, but you decided not to take it serious. You're like, no, I don't want to believe this. Child of God, God has exposed them, and it's in your place to use wisdom to separate yourself from them, to use wisdom to shift away from them. But the Lord will definitely judge them, because God is a God of justice. He's a God of justice. He's a just God. And he's a God of vengeance. Child of God, the Lord has delivered you with this word. Try to keep your things. Try to stay quiet about them. Try as much as you can. Yes, I know you love this person so much. I know you're so close. But child of God, they are the very cause of your problems. They are the very cause of your problems. And you need to be wise enough. In the name of Jesus, amen. May the Lord grant you wisdom. May the Lord give you wisdom in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.